Welcome everyone. I just got back from boothing at EGX in London with my wife and it was awesome. Boy, do we have a ton of bugs to figure out. Overall, it was a pretty cool experience, but we definitely need some AI racers to make it a little more fulfilling. We want the game to be at least eight racers at one time, maybe 12. So either two groups of four or three groups of four. The idea is by the end of the year to have a few new characters playable and also AI racing so that you're able to really race against a full group like we intended. Right now it's a reverse blue 2v2 match and it kind of sucks to be able to only hit two players even if you can help your one ally. We did make it a little more clear at EGX by having a like symbol or color above the head of the characters and that was helping just make it a little bit more clear who you're ally was. We actually had a fan from EGX give us a shader that hopefully will help outline the character so it's even more apparent and more obvious like who your allies and enemies will be. Also we ran into a bunch of bugs that I hadn't seen before so I'm super happy to be able to test at a higher level. When I'm over here testing by myself or with a maybe a one or two people from the team it's impossible to kind of get some of the bugs that we were getting with a group effort and everything so really going to these events has really helped with the QA effort in general, kind of getting some uh, quality of life fixes and everything and user experience fixes. I'm also really excited to make some of these new characters. I want to show you some of the sketches right now. These are super early preliminary sketches, but I wanted to show where we're headed in the near future for characters and character designs and just trying to get really fun, wacky, unique characters in the early roster. I'm also looking for other entries if you're on our Discord channel or just want to comment below, then definitely let us know what kind of characters you'd like to see in the future. And if you want to have a description of characters, definitely send us in the comments just a fun description of a character that you think would be a lot of fun to make or to, to play, and we'll definitely think about it. Right now we also have our art contest going on, so if you want to participate in the art contest, you have a very short amount of time to wrap it up by the end of this month, so, so the 1st of November is when it's due. The art contest is for the next character coming out, Scout, right now I have her as, uh, his early name is Scout, and she is kind of a space marine character, and I'm really looking forward to having some kind of either cool hover bike, which is the original design for her cart, was a hover, hover motorcycle, or to have a actual space marine-like heavy tread, shoot, you know, guns in the front kind of thing. But just remember that if you're going to enter into the contest, you yeah, November 1st, and then also really try to get the essence of the game so far look at the other characters look at the other vehicles and see kind of the style that we're going for roughly proportion wise a character is one third of the the whole mass of the vehicle so like the vehicle it might be three times the character's mass and then the weapon is usually going to be like one third of the character so the rule of three really still applies in this section we have a new tutorial about to come out as well if you're interested in character art or props that kind of thing and also vehicles similar to what we we're doing in Chaos Cart, then definitely check out our Udemy page. We have a course coming out that will be for all those things, and I'm super excited about that to come out because it will really show off what you can do as a 3D artist if you're looking into me in the games, and it shows kind of the gamut of you know character, prop, vehicle, all the major things that you might make asset-wise that aren't going to be into the environment art side. The course will be run by me and one of the rigging and animation artists from Buck Rose Entertainment, Aaron Caprell. We have some really cool stuff planned ahead for Chaos Cart. Let me know in the comments below if you like this new format of doing videos more like quality and quick. If you do like our old live streams, then I'm considering doing that on Twitch. Maybe I'll keep on doing them here if we get enough people that say, you know, just it's fine to do it here. But I think for the most part, people will just want to have these quick videos. And this kind of seems like more of a YouTube thing to do anyway. And I'm thinking to have most of our expository tutorialization stuff that I was doing in the live streams just on its own tutorial stuff such as Udemy and Wing Fox and that kind of thing. Hello to our new fans from EGX. Thanks for joining and subscribing. I'm looking to do one upload per week of this kind of format of video. Talking about the new characters coming out and the new mechanics that we're doing and that kind of thing. And I'll have it try to be as much fun as possible with as much like B-roll of actual gameplay to make it more interesting and fun and more obvious about what we're doing. I'm looking for publishers still, so if you're a publisher out there, give us a shout on my business email, which is in the About Me page thing, or just contact, 
or just comment on the below or just comment below in the comments and let us know that you're looking for us and we'll definitely hit you up. After all the other publishers I've talked to, I think Humble Games might be one of the publishers that I'm really considering. If we do any more events soon, it'll likely be Gamescom Germany. There's a few other ones I'm considering doing in the UK that are more local, and possibly PAX Australia, which is sound like a blast to do, and like, be more of a journey than I think better ROI, but still could be a lot of fun. If I can pull it off, I think I'm going to. Thanks for watching. I'm looking forward to talking to you guys again soon about Chaos Cart, Baka Bros, or just in general life. Peace. Physics. Thank you all for your support and being our Baka bros. Happy developing, bros. This is my hair now. I told the Scottish guys to give me a manly haircut, and this is uh, what I have now. Fancy.